Let's make it happen. Action! Another one in the bag. This, this footage, it's unearthly. It's a masterpiece. Cut! Sensational, sensational, Kasuga-san! I've never seen such realism in film or in life. That's nice. Hey, where's James at? I thought he was filming, right? I don't see him. Why, he's right there, beside you the whole time. Huh? Oh, jeez! You scared the shit out of me! Born witness. That was the apex of filmmaking. Nathan must have felt this way the whole time. You were by my side the entire shoot? Yes. God, yes. He insisted on capturing every frame himself, and now look at him. That, my colleagues, is the face of an artiste. I just checked out the raw footage, and it's sublime. The rumbling of the trucks, the fragrance of the diesel, it's all there! Palpable. I'm so humbled to have shot this. Oh, well, I can see it meant a lot to you. I barely recognize the bully I met with Nathan way back when. Please, don't remind me of that. But you're right. Without him, I'd still be that same closed-minded, egotistical, multi-award-winning flesh in the pan. I have to find a way to thank him. I think you should communicate that through your movie. I'm sure Nathan would like it. Yeah. From now on, I'll pour my heart, my passion, and my regret into every scene for the rest of the shoot. Great. Good luck to you. I'm curious, how are you planning to use today's shot? Even with our practical effects, this won't pass for science fiction. Glad you asked. I'm going to use CGI but only to alter the background and augment our real footage. Splendid. You must let me see the final print when it's complete. Huh? What's gotten into you, Director? After all this time, you're capitulating to James's use of special effects? You literal moron! I'm capitulating to nothing. I'll never abandon my pursuit of realism. That's it. I'm wise enough to know that verisimilitude alone does not entertain an audience. I've learned that James Taylor's chic cinematic sensibilities stand for something as well. If I can master them too, I'll be unstoppable as a director. Yeah, that's awesome. Please, you have my invitation to review everything I do. I want all the advice you've got. Sounds like you both found a way to grow from one another. See, we can underlay a backdrop here, no problem. But in the tight shot, we'll lose momentum. Indeed, the farther shot would be more appropriate, which would... Hey, what if an extra gets blown across the screen as we transition? Hmm? That would certainly draw the eye. They're in their own world, it looks like. Guess that's how masters of an art form communicate. Mm-hmm. It's useless trying to stop them now. Oh, by the way, James gave me this. He said to consider it a bonus for nailing the shot. He asked me to hold on to it for you, just in case either of you blew up here today. Anyway, here you are. It's been a pleasure once again, friend. Thank you. Yeah, thank you too. Well, guess I'll head out. Okay, but the truck driver wailing as he flies headlong through the windshield? Post or practical? 
<laughs> I think that's one that calls for the magic of the set, Mr. Taylor. Oh, kasuga san Hmm? Would you mind getting into the driver's seat of that truck for a second? The seat the driver gets killed in? I'm asking you as well, boy. Don't worry. We've got loads of pillows and blankets for the pieces of you to land on. What is it with you and thinking pillows and blankets make it okay? No, I'm done. I'm leaving. Oh, come on, please. We have a chance at making the perfect movie here. Please. We need you. Okay, get this straight. I'm retiring from movies forever. Wait, hold on. 